Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So there are high possibilities that CSIR UGC net exam is going to be conducted offline from now. Now this I'm telling based upon what NTA has decided for UGC net. And let's talk about this in, in this particular video. Okay, because if this is going to happen, there are a lot many things which are going to change. Okay, so let's talk about this in detail. So if you guys know about it, CSIR UGC net exam used to be conducted offline that means in pen and paper mode on the OMR sheet we used to get a physical question paper physical OMR sheet and we used to circle down and that's how the exam was conducted and this was till 2018 okay but in 2018 CSIR decided that now the exam will be conducted by like NT is going to conduct that before that before 2018 CSIR and UGC used to conduct this exam okay they were the agencies which were responsible for conducting the exam as well. But now NTA has taken the responsibility and NTA started taking the exam in CBT that means computer based test mode. Now although it was a modernization approach it was like an approach of digital India and uh, it was an approach in which, uh, which we all were very much excited about because online exam has its own benefits okay you get the calculator you get the things and with the modern approach we should be having online exams it saves a lot of time it it does a lot of it has a lot of pros actually but but there is a darker side of it because since i have been following this csi net exam i am following this exam before this online exam before the cbt like i think from 2017 i am following this exam i have given my first exam in 2016 so i still remember that time but since the time csir has converted this into online mode there this was a whole mess Okay, I have never heard that the exam went smoothly any year. There were like uh, like system failures, which is now very common for CSIR exams. Like people started losing interest into that because of the same reason. Because when they used to like, there are many students who complain about it that their system is not working, or in between the server is shutting down, and their exam is restarting. There is no network. So many, so many complaints used to come after every exam in the last exam it was like in the last few years actually in the last few cycles of exam there were more complaints of like cheating and all other things they, if you will search on youtube you will find a lot of videos related to that and my student themselves they used to tell me that they have prepared so much for the exam but just because of the server just because of the poor management they were not able to do well in the exam and it actually has affected many students so now why I'm telling that this CSIR net exam can be offline or can be conducted offline because UGC net exam which also like in 2018 itself NTA has started taking this exam before that UGC used to conduct this exam by the way let me tell you that UGC net exam is for students belonging to non-science background means from arts and commerce background okay so for those students there is a UGC net exam they also get JRF they also have the exam pattern quite similar to CSIR net but yeah, for them, NTA started taking the exam in 2018 and for them also NTA has taken online exam. But now for the next exam, for the next regulation that is for June 2024 exam, the application uh, process has started and in that notification they have mentioned clearly that this time the exam is going to be OMR paper and pen mode that means in the offline mode. You can see that notification over here. Although this notification is for UGC net. Uh, CSR net notification has yes, yet to be announced it's not announced also UGC net date has been decided and it is 16th of June which we were expecting for CSR net so in the second week of June we are we were expecting CSR net but probably now uh, the CSR net exam will be will be delayed a little bit maybe in the last week of June that's what we can expect but the application portal or the application process of CSIR UGC net has not yet started but there are high chances that because the, the agency is same the agency which is conducting this exam is same that is NTA it might take this exam or it might start this exam in an offline mode just like for UGC net but there are things which which might be the reason why they should not do that one of that reason is the use of calculator now CSIR does not uh, like allow scientific calculator for the exam but in the last exam just in the last CSIR December 2023 exam there was a calculator there was a scientific calculator and an exam before that that means in CSIR June 2023 also we had a 
scientific calculator in the chemistry exam okay before that there there won't be like there was no scientific calculator and when the offline exam was there of course there was no scientific calculator so it's like a new thing which csir was introducing although csir has never mentioned or it there was no mention about scientific calculator on their app like in the notification or in their uh, like brochure or anywhere okay but in the exam we used to have that in the online exam but if this exam is going to be conducted offline now then again you are not going to get the scientific calculator and not having scientific calculator that means the level of questions especially physical chemistry question is again going to be like reverted back and the advanced questions which CSR used to ask these days like the tough questions of physical chemistry which requires a lot of calculator uh, or which requires the, the input of scientific calculator where logarithmic calculations and other things are involved probably that is going to be like taken back if if the exam is going to be conducted in offline mode so there are high chances because nta has reverted the whole system from online to offline for ugc there are high chances that they can do the same thing for csir if they do that the implication the direct implication which i can assume is that the level of physical chemistry question is going to be reverted back what you guys think about it according to me they should not do it okay uh, it should be online just they should work upon their management they should work upon how to conduct the exam uh, carefully and how to choose the centers carefully okay they should give good centers they should give like just like gate see gate is also online exam they are doing it flawlessly okay because gate chooses their exam centers very carefully the management is very good and all the things happens very smoothly so csr instead of you know reverting back everything to the on offline mode i will uh, like what i will think my personal opinion is that they should work upon the management and they should try to look upon a way in which they can improve the experience to their students rather than you know taking the online feature and giving them offline what you guys prefer online or offline do let me know but if you will ask me i will prefer an online mode with a good management like i like the way how gate exams are conducted and that's how CSIR should learn, UGC, NTA should learn and they should conduct exams in that way. So that's all from my side for this particular video. I just wanted to make a discussion with you all. So let's wait for the official announcement from CSIR, NTA, UGC and you can expect the application very soon, maybe in 10 days. Okay, you can expect that CSIR, NTA, UGC net June 2024 application process might start. In at least you should get a notification about that and uh, let's be hopeful let's see what uh, nta and csir decides this time so that's all from my side for this particular video thank you so much for watching i will see you guys in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care